What is going on guys? How's everyone doing today? I am back here with another video and today we are going to be attempting to drift this bad boy right here. And I say attempting because this car being a hybrid, it doesn't have a lot of horsepower. It's not made to go fast. So I don't know how well I'm going to be able to whip this thing in a circle. I do have some things to help a little bit more like assist in drifting a little bit. And if you know anything about drifting front wheel drive cars, you probably already know what I got in the back. But before we get into this video, I have to ask you guys if you noticed anything different about like the image on my video like color wise and all that sort of stuff because I've been fiddling around with like saturation and sharpness and all that sort of stuff obviously it doesn't look different right now but if I turn it on right now you might be able to tell a difference I don't know if you guys like it let, let me know because I want to give you guys the best possible quality videos that I can produce with a GoPro so if you guys enjoy this type of scenery or image let me know because personally i like it but it doesn't matter what i like it's a matter if, if you guys like it so let me know down in the comments if you do enjoy this type of image better but i think i rambled on enough we have to get into this video like i said this car being front wheel drive we are going to need to put some stuff under these oh, under these wheels to give it some assistance to actually whip this thing around so the two things i'm going to be using to get this thing to try to do a circle is not just one lunch tray wow that was a lot harder than i expected but two two lunch trays we're going to be using two lunch trays to try to get this thing to at least do a donut I'd, I'd like to do a donut if i can drift i don't know i don't know how well it's going to hold up because this thing does have a tendency to overheat when the batteries are put under like a lot of stress so if i get stuck out here well that's a big rip um if the car catches on fire that's another big rip because i don't have any water to put it out but let's not think about the negatives let's think about the positives because i believe this is gonna work so what we are gonna need to do we are gonna need to push these two lunch trays under these back tires now hopefully i got a big enough lunch tray it seems uh maybe maybe did i it seems that i did get big enough lunch trays i really didn't care too much about the size these things were like a dollar 30 a piece but the shipping was like 13 dollars. i don't know why amazon you really gotta you really gotta do something about that but we gotta put those bad boys under there and somehow i'm gonna have to roll up well obviously i know how i'm gonna roll up but i don't want them to slide as i'm trying to roll up that's one on and maybe yep two is on now all we gotta do don't mind the don't mind the junk i got stuff falling off this car left and right now we gotta do is pull this pull yep there we go and we should be set we should theoretically be set to drift this car now like i said i don't know how well this is gonna go I don't know if I'm going to be able to whip this thing, but I am going to try my best. Uh, fingers crossed because I, I don't want to get stuck out here. I don't want to call for someone to pick me up, but we're going to try. And we will try with the best of our ability. So let's get this show on the road. So hopefully you guys are set up in a pretty good spot. I'm going to try my best to stay in this general area. Hopefully I can keep in the picture frame or the video for I don't know what you would call it I also want to apologize some wind is coming in I am in an open field so we're just gonna have to deal with a little bit of wind noise right now but fingers crossed this works and I don't get stranded out here and I can drive home safely so let's get this started I don't know. I, 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 did, I did one drift and I'm stuck. I think I can get out. I don't know what's going on. I'm hitting the gas and nothing's happening, but, but we'll, we'll see. We'll see. I, uh, I figured out why I I wasn't going anywhere. Um, 
this is it's just it just melted. Well, um, wow, that's hmm. I was expecting to get a little more drifting out of it, but considering I physically can't drift anymore, um, yeah, that um, I I don't know what to do anymore. This this yeah so obviously for a little bit this did work let me shut off the car for a second this did work but as you can tell um i didn't want this to happen and yeah there, there's some there's a there's holes in my in my tray so if you're wondering if you want to do this get some high quality trays because you will put i don't even know how i put a hole well that's that's stupid because I, I I do know how I put a hole in in those in those trays. Well, ladies and gentlemen, um, I I don't know what else what else to do. Um, there there are holes in my trays. That was basically going to be my video. That's the only way I can drift this car is if I have these trays. And as you can see, I'm going to be dragging rubber this whole time. And you could say I could use a little bit of space here, a little bit of space there. But as you can see, I'm kind of tearing this uh, up a little bit. I didn't really want to do that. Um, it, it was fun. It was funny, uh, but it kind of it kind of failed. Um, thankfully, um, you know, the car's still running. Um, I kind of just want to do one more one more one more thing before we leave. So let me set you guys back up. I smell, I smell a lot of brake coming from that. Okay, so, well, it's good to know that in any case that I need to slide out of a situation, that this car is semi, semi capable of doing so. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's probably gonna end today's video. Obviously, I wanna shut this thing off before it blows up on me, but that is gonna end today's video. I wanna apologize because I already did an outro for this video. I already filmed like what I'm gonna be saying as of right now, but I noticed that my field of view was on narrow and usually I have it on medium. So I don't know how much of this video is of a different field of view. And I really want to apologize because um, I, I have no idea when that happened. I never film on narrow um, and it, I don't know I just don't know. So I want to apologize for that first and foremost. And we have learned that if you are going to be drifting your Honda Insight, specifically your Honda Insight, doesn't matter if it's front wheel drive, specifically your Honda Insight, get some quality trays so that this does not happen to you. It literally melted the plastic. I thought I was going to get just a little more life out of them. I don't know why. I'm just stupid for thinking that but I was hoping to get a little more drifting. For you guys, it's really unfortunate that those trays couldn't hold up a little bit longer because I was having fun. That one drift, that one circle that we did, that was genuinely fun. And um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video as well. And I hope you're enjoying the Insight content. I know this is my first video on this car, but I'm genuinely having fun with it because I never had a car that I could just beat the crap out of. And it's just, it's just really fun. I hope it shows on camera as well. But before I end this video, I want you guys to know that I'm actually keeping this car till May. I said that the inspection goes out in April, but with everything going on with like COVID-19 and all that sort of stuff, everything in Pennsylvania, say your inspection went out in March or April, your car gets pushed till May. So we indeed have this car for an entire another month. Now, obviously I only have like three videos in mind that I kind of want to make with it, but it's good that we have this bad boy for another month. But ladies and gentlemen, that's going to end it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Obviously, if you did, make sure you leave it a like. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. And as always, guys, I'll see each and every one of you in my next upload.